Welcome, readers, to Read Aloud with Mrs. Na. I am so excited to read this book with you today. This book is called "Hooray for Fly Guy" by Ted Arnold. Hmm. Because reading is thinking, I'm already starting to think. I think Buzz. I mean, I think Fly Guy must do something incredible in a game because it's called "Hooray for Fly Guy." I wonder what he does. "Hooray for Fly Guy" by Ted Arnold. For my alma mater, the University of Florida, and our great sports teams, go Gators! Hmm. Ted Arnold must have graduated from University of Florida. That's what alma mater means. I did not know that. No wonder he uses blue and orange. A boy had a pet fly. He named him Fly Guy. Fly Guy could say the boy's name. Buzz. Can you look at the picture? And find the name of Buzz's football team. Yeah, it's called the Go Getters, and it's funny because he has the letter G on his helmet, like the Gators, which is Ted Arnold's, Arnold's alma mater. Chapter one: Fly Guy went with Buzz to play football. Coach said, "We need one more player for the big game." Hmm. I wonder if this is where Buzz comes in. Oh, actually, I meant to say, I wonder when if this is where Fly Guy comes in. Buzz said, "Fly Guy can play." Coach laughed. Flies can't play football. They're all laughing. To be honest, I would laugh too because look at the size of Fly Guy, and then look at the size of the football. How was he supposed to carry a football? Buzz said, "Fly guy, show him what you can do." Fly guy kicked the ball. Oh, look at the picture. What happens? He gets squished by the ball. Fly guy went out for a pass. Oh no! Fly guy is being thrown into the football. Looks like. Fly guy tried to tackle Buzz. Doesn't seem like he succeeded at that. I was right," said Coach. "Flies can't play football, but he can come to the game." Chapter two. It was the day before the big game. Buzz made a helmet for Fly Guy. What did Buzz use to make this helmet? Look at the picture. Yeah, he used a popcorn kernel, and I see a paintbrush with a little bit of blue paint. I see a knife he must have carved out for Fly Guy's head. They played football. Ooh, he's sitting on the football as the football soars through the sky. They did jumping jacks. Can you show me two jumping jacks? They planned a secret play. They made up a touchdown dance. Show me your favorite touchdown dance. That's a good one. They went to the big game. Coach said a new player joined our team. Fly Guy sat on the bench. How do you think Fly Guy must feel? Yeah, I think he's a little disappointed that he can't play. Seems to be frowning and sad. The game started. His team scored. Fly Guy cheered. Looks excited. The other team scored. Fly Guy worried. The other team scored a lot. Oh no! Looks like he's biting his nails. He's so nervous. Chapter three. Finally, there was one second left in the game. That is not a lot of time. The big game. So, Fly Guy and Buzz's team is called the Go Getters. They're at 14, and the other team is at 17 points. Do you know the difference between 17 and 14? How many more points do they need? 15, 16, 17. They need three more points. 
The other team was ahead. They were about to score again. The other team. Looks like if you look closely, their team's name must be Dogs. And I see a picture of a dog on their helmet. And the new player was hurt. Oh man, looks like he really got hit hard. I wonder if Fly Guy is going to be asked to come in. Because it looks like the new player is being taken off the field. Coach said, okay Fly Guy, you can play now. The game is lost anyway. Buzz said, it's time for our secret play. Ooh, I'm excited. I wonder what happens. Fly Guy went to the line. So the team's name is Mad Dogs. The Mad Dogs team looks like they're ready to win. I'm looking at the go-getters, and they seem a little bit nervous about this. At least that guy does. But Fly Guy looks like he's ready. The other team snapped the ball to their quarterback and Fly Guy flew fast and straight. Fly Guy is determined, I can tell by this face. He flew right up the quarterback's nose. The boy dropped the ball, a choo, and Buzz picked it up and ran. Oh my goodness, he better run as fast as he can because I think there was only one second left of the game. He scored! Fly Guy and Buzz did their touchdown dance. Looks like a silly dance to me. Can you show me your touchdown dance again? The team cheered. We won! Hooray for Fly Guy! Hey, that's the name of the book. Readers, thanks for reading this book with me. I have loved this time with you. I'll see you again on Read Aloud with Mrs. Knox.